Greetings, fellow wanderers of wonder. Join me on an immersive journey through China's exquisite masterpiece, the Summer Palace, as we uncover its secrets, history, and the captivating stories woven within its walls. Nestled in the Hadian district of Beijing, the Summer Palace is a living testament to the opulence and artistic prowess of China's imperial history. Spanning over 2.9 square kilometers, this majestic complex paints a picture of harmonious coexistence between nature and architectural brilliance. Our quest begins in the 18th century, during the Qing Dynasty. The Qianlong Emperor, with an aspiration for a summer retreat that matched his dynasty's grandeur, orchestrated the birth of the Summer Palace. To truly understand the enchantment of the Summer Palace, we must explore its three main sections, the Outer Garden, the Middle Garden, and the Inner Garden. The Outer Garden, the largest part of the palace, transports us through a visual symphony of architecture and nature. Dominated by the serene Kunming Lake, this garden is a paradise for those seeking tranquility. Moving to the middle garden, we find a realm of seclusion and sophistication. Private gardens and pavilions are the heartbeats of this section, each boasting tales of emperors finding solace amidst the intricacies of nature. Our final destination within the gardens is the inner garden, a realm veiled in imperial exclusivity. Reserved for the emperor and his inner circle, this area offers a glimpse into the secluded lifestyle of the royal elite. Like many great stories, the Summer Palace faced its share of adversity. The Second Opium War in 1860 brought chaos, destruction, and loss to its doorstep. British and French forces, driven by political turmoil, looted and set fire to the palace. However, this tale takes a remarkable twist. The palace's phoenix-like resilience soared as it emerged from the ashes, brought back to life through rigorous restoration efforts. The Chinese spirit triumphed over adversity, preserving the legacy of the palace for generations to come. Let's unveil some of the Summer Palace's most iconic treasures that stand as witnesses to its regal past. Behold the Marble Boat, a poetic fusion of opulence and whimsy. Built in the 18th century, this ornate structure of white marble gracefully floats on the tranquil waters of Kunming Lake. The graceful longevity hill beckons us to ascend its heights. Atop this 60-meter high hill stands the Tower of Buddhist Incense, an architectural marvel that graces the skyline and offers panoramic views of the palace's breathtaking scenery. Embracing its grandeur, the Summer Palace earned its rightful place as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Its unique fusion of architectural excellence and natural aesthetics is a testament to China's profound contribution to world culture and heritage. The Summer Palace isn't merely a historical relic, it's a living sanctuary for flora and fauna. Over 170,000 trees and plants, including rare species, thrive here. Additionally, the palace hosts cultural events, bringing traditional performances and art to life within its hallowed grounds. As we bid adieu to the Summer Palace, we're left with a profound sense of awe. It's not just a palace, it's a symphony of nature, history, resilience, and artistic brilliance. It's a living embodiment of China's essence, resonating through the ages. Delving deeper, we unravel the cultural significance woven into every corner of the Summer Palace. Its architecture, adorned with intricate carvings and vibrant paintings, mirrors the elegance of China's artistic heritage. Within this cultural mosaic lies the calligraphy corridor, an awe-inspiring 728-meter-long covered walkway. Adorned with classical Chinese calligraphy and paintings, it's a living canvas depicting tales of valor, wisdom, and timeless beauty. Our journey takes us to the heart of spirituality at the Temple of Buddhist Virtue. Constructed in the 18th century, this resplendent temple offers a glimpse into the spiritual pursuits of the emperors, adorned with intricate statues and sacred relics. Witness the kaleidoscope of seasons that breathe life into the summer palace. In spring, cherry blossoms blanket the gardens in delicate hues, while summers bring vibrant greenery. Autumn paints the scenery in warm tones, and in winter, the palace transforms into a snow-covered wonderland. As you plan your visit to this mesmerizing realm, keep in mind some practical tips to make the most of your experience. The summer palace opens its gates at 6 a.m., welcoming early birds to witness the tranquil sunrise. Remember to grab a map to navigate its vast expanse, and comfortable footwear is a must for the immersive journey that awaits. After an enchanting exploration, savor the flavors of Beijing's local cuisine. Numerous dining options offer delightful treats to recharge your spirit. It's a culinary journey that harmoniously blends history and gastronomy. 
As we conclude our voyage through the Summer Palace, let this chapter serve as an invitation to you, dear viewer. Walk its storied paths, marvel at its treasures, and absorb the grandeur that has echoed through generations. Remember, each step you take becomes a brushstroke in the canvas of its history. Until we meet again on another journey of discovery, stay curious, stay inspired, and keep exploring.